Hey folks, so I know I'm sounding a bit like a broken record with um, talking about AI and chat GPT pretty much every week, um, but you know, it's basically going to change everything, including, especially I think, coming soon, onboarding experience and user experience in general. And I think much that, you know, I'm approaching AI with certain trepidation I would say because I'm afraid that you know I want to be able to adapt in time and that our marketing department will not be able to adapt and that the product will not be able to adapt in time I think the changes for user experience and for product managers will be overwhelmingly positive and in the newsletter below um one of our readers um has actually pointed out uh, your guys are watching this in a new um, window, so you don't see what's below. But in the newsletter where I'm sending this video, in any case, um, well, the power of habits, and um, I'm walking you through several ways how AI products can improve use onboarding. So without further ado, well, number one is segmentation and product analytics. Segmentation as we know it, I think will become history pretty soon when machine learning becomes more ubiquitous and product analytics tools, it will be able to dynamically segment the users into even like single user segments. So essentially analyze all the usage data on record, analyze all the user attributes, um, based on the CRM and based on um, the user attributes that you have in your um, products database and essentially draw conclusions based on that. Um, how to treat this particular user based also on large volumes of um, previous users data, kind of recognize these patterns and you know allocate the kind of help resources um, to this user that will be most appropriate for them. So um, that will also allow us to draw conclusions um, and it will allow us to essentially use predictive analytics. So be able to tell based on the data from previous users and matching them with their new user's profile, like how likely this user is to convert, how likely um, they are to activate and what needs to be done to help them on this and to prevent them from churning. So yeah, that will be also immensely helpful for sales, I think. Um, and another, another obvious kind of um, consequence of applying AI to user onboarding and product adoption tools will be personalization of the user onboarding flows. So goodbye product tools that we all hate. Um, welcome 100% personalized and individual um, interactive walkthrough and um, product onboarding experience that will be tailored to their specific individual users needs in real time. So say the tool recognizes that you need to adopt certain features in a certain order to achieve a certain goal. Um, and it will you know, dynamically point out these features to you as you go, while also adjusting the copy, even possibly not only to your user of profile, but also your mood. Um, I've been reading some studies about um, the connection between mood recognition and eye movements. This is pretty creepy, but essentially what I'm trying to say is that the interactive walkthroughs will finally become truly personalized to the individual user rather than having some you know, first name tags in them and then just being equally ineffective and the same for everyone. And then another obvious use case for applying AI for product adoption is providing self-serve support. So when AI will not only query your help docs, knowledge bases, but will also rely on the previous user's data to provide answers to users' question and even dynamically generate walkthroughs based on your user's novel questions, there also will be the point where you can pretty much replace customer um, support, possibly customer success, and 
because you know your help dogs your knowledge bases your human resources will never be able to cover all the possible use cases and all the possible ways in which your users mess up with your tool and use it wrong and all the possible questions they might have so that kind of interactive ai um help bot will be incredibly incredibly useful um and yeah i'm really looking forward to seeing all that happen let me know what you think and if you think um chat gpt and ai solutions will improve user experience looking forward to hearing from you and see you next week bye bye